Marco Levy, whom we, we know quite well because Marco has, uh, has uh, graduated from our bachelor program. After that, uh, continued his studies in Copenhagen and Stockholm. And, and, uh, and after that, indeed, uh, continued uh, doctoral uh, studies at our faculty. So, and now he is on the final stage and is going to defend his uh, dissertation. So let's get started. Why look into this topic? <laughs> There is plenty of reasons, but I will just mention a few. First of all, well, we've seen uh, a wave of globalization and liberalization of markets in the past couple of decades. And more recently, we're beginning to see this in electricity markets, which traditionally have been a very closed and government-owned uh, activity. So this is no longer the case. We have a lot of countries where this has already been happening for the past 10, 20 years even. Um, we have a lot of countries where this is happening now, and there is even more countries where this is to happen in the near future. Why look at Nord Pool? Um, because this is the coolest thing ever when it comes to liberalized electricity markets. This is the first fully liberalized regional electricity market. Uh, and then, of course, I would like to con congratulate Marco on a very interesting dissertation. It's a novel approach, uh, and it's filling a gap. This is now a producer of electricity and renewable energy. These are controlled variables for the producer, while these are exogenously given. And also the way you have presented it and defended it, my, my uh, remarks to it, definitely fulfill the requirements of the doctorate degree as I see it. Thank you very much. What I would like to say is that uh, originality and novelty of the dissertation is ways to analyze the outcome of the liberalization of the electricity market. And that's why this dissertation has a very high practical value, because this can give very concrete recommendation for the government, for example, what to do in the future. In conclusion, my opinion is that the dissertation of Marco Wieding should be evaluated positively. The dissertation clearly fulfills the standards of a PhD dissertation. Therefore, I recommend for faculty of the Economics and Business Administration at the University of Tartu to award the degree of Doctor of Philosophy to Marco Vidi. Now, uh, final word. Do, can you imagine this is final word for you? Before committee is going to yeah. decide. <laughs> uh -huh. Yes. Um, um, well, actually, it is a good thing you're standing here, Maya, and uh, taking this, uh, this, this, uh, uh, leading this dissertation, because you are the one that uh, invited me uh, to do the PhD studies. Uh, she has been uh, reminding me that uh, studies don't need to stop with masters, uh, but they can go on where you can go further and look into stuff that really interests you. And I, uh, I really appreciate that you encouraged me to and start the PhD studies. And little did you know of, um, but I have already won the jackpot uh, before getting the degree. I met my wife during the PhD studies. Well, I met her actually in another university and she was a master student. But the point is, I would not have met her if I had not been a PhD student. So, uh, my beautiful wife, Emily, uh, who is sitting there, uh, the mother of my two kids. Um, this is the jackpot, so uh, another reason to do PhD studies, that you meet interesting people. I would have done the whole thing again. I, I think this has been a great joyride, and I thank everyone for the support on the way. And I am happy to say that everybody supported you uh, for uh, awarding you with a PhD degree. So, I, we congratulate you. It is done. <laughs> thank you very much. And please, everyone in this room, do um, join us for a small snack and drink in the library, which is just uh, one floor below us. Uh, please, everyone in the room. Thanks, buddy. Thank you.
Поляна.